Ultradance endodontic offerings include everything you need to perform successful post and core procedures. In this video, you'll learn how to use the Unicore post and drill system with Permaflow DC to create a core buildup after finishing root canal therapy. Take an x-ray of the canal and measure the working length. Using the EndoEase ruler, adjust the rubber stopper on the Unicore drill to the depth of the post space for the canal. When working with fiber post placement, we need to remember three things. First, the post should always be at least 10 millimeters in length. Second, the post should be at least two-thirds the length of the tooth. And third, the fiber post placement should be at least 5 millimeters away from the apex of the tooth. Position the tip of the unicorn drill in the pilot hole. Using light pressure, follow the obturation material to the length indicated by the rubber stopper. Keeping the drill at full speed, withdraw from the canal. Use water and the tryaway adapter with the Endoese 22 gauge tip for 10 seconds to rinse debris out of the post space. Cut the post to the appropriate length and seat it in the canal to verify length. Etch the tooth using either a total etch or a self-etch technique. For total etch, attach the 22 gauge endoese tip to the ultra etch syringe and express a small amount to verify flow. For self etch, attach the 22 gauge deliveries brush tip to the Peak SE primer syringe and express a small amount to verify flow. For total etch, deliver ultra etch into the canal from the bottom of the canal to the top and onto the preparation. Leave 20 seconds. For self-etch, apply Peak SE Primer into the canal from the bottom of the canal to the top and onto the preparation and scrub for 20 seconds. Air thin and dry Peak SE with full air pressure for 3 seconds with a tryaway adapter and 22 gauge endoese tip. For total etch, suction excess etchant with lure vacuum adapter and 22 gauge endoese tip. Use tryaway and 22 gauge endoese tip to rinse thoroughly with water. Lightly air dry, leaving the post space slightly damp. Attach the Navitip FX tip to the Peak Universal Bond syringe. Express a small amount to verify flow. Deliver Peak Universal Bond to the canal, filling from the bottom of the canal to the top. Gently agitate the adhesive for 10 seconds. Thin and dry peak universal bond with full air pressure for 10 seconds with the tryaway adapter and the Endoese 22 gauge tip. Light cure the adhesive in the post space for 20 seconds. Use the Unicore post to ensure the post space is not obstructed with adhesive. Place the mixing tip on the end of the dual barrel Permaflow DC syringe, then attach the intraoral tip to the mixing tip. Express a small amount of the cement to verify flow. Use 
Use the intraoral tip to deliver the mixed permaflow DC into the post space, beginning from the bottom of the post space to the top. Insert the Unicore post and seat. Light cure the permaflow DC in the canal through the post for 20 seconds. The Unicore post's glass fiber composition transmits light to initiate curing all the way down to the bottom of the post. Flow permaflow DC around the post for core buildup. If fill starts to slump, light cure for 2 to 3 seconds. Repeat with each individual layer. Final cure with Velo for 20 seconds or 40 seconds if using another curing light with less than 600 milliwatts per centimeter squared. Proceed with crown preparation or restorative procedure. For more information on Unicore or any of Ultradent's other products, call 800-552-5512 or visit ultradent.com.